Test Drive with Graham Fletcher. Pop in, Brad. Nice braking, Graham. Fortunately for you, they work this time. I'll say. Well, what are we test driving this week? This is the new Ford Pro. It's a Mazda Ford joint venture. It uses the same powertrain and engine and everything else as the MX-6 or the 626. But as you can see, it's got its own very individual look to it. 2.2 litre, 12 valve engine under the hood with a five speed standard. So it should be fun. Okay, for our first test, let's try the zero to 100 kilometer time. It's important that this is a reasonable time for merging safely on the highway and stuff like that. Not too bad at all. Okay, Brad, let's try her through the cones and see how she handles. To determine the brake efficiency, we're going to use the decelerometer. And it shows the deceleration rate in feet per second squared. When we use the conversion chart, we'll be able to find out exactly how many feet that is. 27, that's pretty good. Here, the interior noise level is very quiet. The suspension is different from that of the MX-6. It's a little stiffer sprung. You look at it from the outside and it says Ford, but inside it, they've left so much Japanese influence in here, and I think that's to their credit. Now, Graham, I know you, and you've always got a pet peeve. Do you have a pet peeve for the probe? Yes, I do. My pet peeve with the probe was that during our brake testings, the rear brakes had a little bit of a tendency to lock up too early. That aside, on the whole, we like the probe and think Ford has got a definite winner on its hands. Let's go to the scoreboard. Braking. Five out of ten for that, I'm afraid, because of my pet peeve. The handling, excellent. Acceleration, again, more than adequate. The sound level at 68 decibels is very respectable. 31 miles per gallon won't hurt anybody's pocket at that rate. Next week, Graham will examine four-wheel steering.